Hello, welcome to Studio Pixel. This is the fourth chapter of rigging in Maya. In the previous chapter, we have already created the hand joints, and uh, we also already also show you how to mirror a, a joint structure. And we'll just continue uh, for creating the lower portion of the body, that is legs. Now, I'll just put this cloth into the another layer so that I can create the, my uh, joints of it from there so I'll just uh, create my leg joints from the side view so that I can uh, have my you know the right position according to my model so go to the joint tool I have already you know uh, set the values over there as you can see so I've set it to the 0.5 and I'll just uh, okay just uh, create a oh, three joints structure and later on I'll just uh, concentrate to place these more accurately just middle mouse and bridge over here and that's it Go to the front view and from the move tool you can adjust this position and I'll just position over over this area because that is uh, my intention my legs will be rotation rotate from this point let's move on to the perspective so that it will be absolutely in the middle fine now you can't be straight because uh, my legs are not absolutely straight the character is uh, standing a, a bit you know widening their his feet so I'll just rotate the base joint just like this and you can see that my joints position is not exactly what I am want to so use the scale tool and you just uh, manipulate the position of your joints fine also for my ankles and I have to see whether this is the portion that you need to have your joints okay you can see the cuts uh, that's where actually our uh, legs uh, our foot bends over this muscle so this is the this is the point where uh, you need to have this joint fine now as I have already created my position almost you can rotate this or just scale it up a bit upwards just small amount that's it now uh, the most important part that is freeze transformation because I have already changed the rotation values of uh, different uh, and also the scale values of uh, different joints so I must freeze my transformation whenever you are freezing your joint values definitely you should look that uh, everything is on reset settings freeze transformation and definitely I will rename my joints that is as I'll just put it leg underscore L underscore FK because uh, I'm also going to uh, show you how to you know control the uh, Ike FK switching in the legs also so it will be FK 
this will be knee underscore L underscore FK this will be ankle underscore L underscore FK and so on the foot underscore L underscore FK and this will be foot tip underscore L underscore FK fine now uh, I have to join this chain with my pelvis now for creating that I'll just uh, as for my planning I want my upper body movement is absolutely separate from my lower body movement so I will not directly connect with this uh, pelvis joint so what I'll do I will create another joint in between like over here for for hip I just uh, create that over there I'll just uh, snap it by pressing V and with the pelvis and I was to just bring it down a bit downwards towards its pelvis the pelvis region Lower, lower pelvis region or the hip region and then what I will do I'll just remit hip underscore FK as it will be in FK I haven't renamed this in pelvis in FK because uh, this is a uh, one single joints if we uh, in future we are going to create the uh, you know the stretchy bones connection and everything then you have to uh, create a two kind of uh, joint structure one is fk one is an ik so right here uh, in in this case for this character i'm not going to uh, show you the stretchy one because uh, that that will not going go through go with this character because it's a very heavy character the stretchiness will not go with this so that's why i haven't uh, make this on uh, as an fk so I just uh, select this two joints or select my leg joint with and my sorry I make it hit sorry F mistake it's not hit sorry it will be hip yeah that's it so select the leg joint shift select my hip joint and press P oh okay before that uh, just uh, make sure you just freeze transform the value so make it P and spanning joint and in the same way shift select and say P and therefore you have already connected that joint with the pelvis if you move pelvis everything will move but whenever you are actually rotating the upper value the upper body portion your lower body portion is not affecting and also if you rotate your hip your lower body is actually moving and your upper body is not exactly you know affected by that so select the leg joint and go to skeleton and rear joint option and I will definitely uh, not going to change the you know the naming conventions and everything so that's why I'm not going to edit the resets because it's all been set it, you, you have uh, if you have seen the last chapter you, you I have explained all the things so just uh, mirror this and that's it your uh, leg joints has been created so this is the basic structure and on the next chapter we'll move on to the uh, pump joints and how to control them so hope you enjoy this please join our facebook page 
uh, Twitter and also uh, stay updated for our new tutorials on different aspects and our YouTube subscription.